Hello YouTube. This is going to be the first installment in my eBay buys of the month. I'm going to try and do this once a month depending on how quickly stuff will ship from China. Some of the stuff was from China, some of it not. I'll go over that in a little bit. I'll also cover how much it cost and how long it took me to get it. First off, got this gyro toy. Any of my older subscribers will remember having played with one of these as a kid. I forget who invented this. It's been around since I want to say the 60s. It's a pretty popular toy. Uh, it was $7.98 shipped. This came from the United States, not from China. So I got it, I want to say, it ordered on October 2nd, got it on October 7th. About five days. So not too bad wait for shipping. I think it came from the East Coast. But as you can see, you spool up this string. It is very old school. The newer ones have a, a plastic pull tab with teeth on it. Once it's loaded up, you start it up and... Oh shit. And it's kind of like a top, but it has gyroscopic uh, leveling, I guess it's called. Pretty fun little toy. You can do a bunch of different stuff. You can put it on the string on the tip and it'll stay on the string. You can also have it spin around on its axis. There's plenty of videos showing what it's capable of. But, again, pretty fun little toy. Kids seem to love it. Especially if they've never experienced anything like that before. And uh, it comes with the stand and the string. Again, $7.98 shipped. So not really a bad deal at all for something fun to play with with the kids. It has its own little box. If I can get it to go back on said box. Anyway, moving on. Next, in case you ever find yourself trapped in a dream, you've seen uh, that movie. This is a stainless steel. It comes with a die for whatever reason, I guess, so you can put it. No, I don't know what this is for. Um, but this was a dollar with a dollar forty-eight shipping, so two forty-eight shipped. Ordered on October second, I believe. I got it just right around two weeks later. Wasn't that bad of a wait, but pretty cool little toy to play with. Oh, Inception, it even says it on the bottom there. So that was the movie where you had to have something to tell you that you weren't trapped in a dream. Um, I guess in the dream it would continue to spin no matter how long you left it, and that would inform you that you were clearly stuck in a dream. Good movie if you haven't seen it. I think that was a Leonardo DiCaprio movie. I forget. Next is, uh, if you've seen Buckyballs, they're kind of these magnetic little BBs. Unfortunately, I didn't pay attention when I ordered this one. It was 543 shipped, ordered on October 2nd, got it on the 22nd. So about a 20 day wait for this guy. Kind of long for uh, Chinese shipping, but uh, it's to be expected. It's coming over on a freight container and uh, depending on weather, it can be delayed. Normally you can break these up into little stacks and make them into a cube, but because these are the smaller ones, these are three millimeter, you want like a five or a six millimeter size ball, and then you can actually cube them up and make all kinds of neat designs with them. It's kind of like metal silly putty. Fun little toy to play with. Like a fidget toy, I guess it's called. But pretty cool little thing, like especially if you're going on a road trip or on a flight or something, it'll keep you occupied, something to play with. You can make shapes out of it and tetrahedrons and whatnot, but not bad for five bucks shipped. Next, I ordered these guys. And these are also magnetic. This was 728 shipped. Ordered on the 2nd, received on the 17th, so 15 day turnaround, about two weeks. And they are very strong neo, neodymium, neodymium, neo, neodymium, I don't know. It's like aluminium, but they're very strong magnets. You can even separate with your fingers and they still attract through your thumb, which is kind of neat. And pretty fun to play with. Also good for um, if you believe in the fact that your blood has iron in it and magnets are attracted to iron, you can rub them on spots on your body and it will 
supposedly promote circulation. There's a lot of research being done with magnets right now, but you can see they're pretty strong, hard to press together. I also purchased one of these guys, but it came with a broken ball already, which is kind of a bummer, but this was really cheap. This was only like two bucks, and it would have been cool if it wouldn't have been broken, but they gave me a full refund, so whatever. Lastly was I saw Wrangler Star do a video on this Morak, Moraknev, Moraknev knife and I pretty much based on watching his video had to have one. It's stainless steel. It is razor blade sharp. This corner here based on his video he cut through some fire hose which is really tough material but this knife is by far going to be one of my workshop knives to have on me at all times. It locks into the case so it's hard to get out. You can't easily drop it. It's got a nice little push for the thumb. And then it has a button snap so that you can attach it to the front of your shirt so it's hanging right in front of your chest at all times. Easy to get to. Definitely good for utility cutting of just about anything. And this guy was not from China. This was in the East Coast, I want to say. Ordered on the 9th, got it on the 13th. So four days later, great shipping time. It was 1661 shipped. Made in Sweden, high quality. They guarantee all their stuff. It's got a great grip. It's got a hell of a blade. So definitely check that out. All right, so that kind of concludes the video for this eBay buys of the month. If you have a few bucks to waste or someone gave you a PayPal payment and you don't really know what to do with it, you can buy one of these fun little toys just to keep yourself busy and entertained on a trip or at home in the office. And uh, definitely a good tool to have if you need a good knife. But hope you liked the video. Like if you liked, subscribe if you want. And as always guys, keep modding.